Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Melissa and today we are going to be going over the Dollar General app. As you can see here, I am already signed into my account. You can sign into accounts by email or phone number. Um, so I already signed in so you guys can't see my phone number. But this is what the home page looks like. This is the Explore Coupons. Now, I have 68 coupons in my account already. So, if you click My Coupons, it shows you everything that I have clipped here. There's daily deals, um, which are new for this week. And there are DG Store Coupons. And then these are manufactured coupons. So you cannot double up um, two manufactured coupons on one single item. But you can, if you have a store coupon and a manufactured coupon, you can double them together. So uh, for example, right here is the Daily Deal Prego. Okay, so it says you need a 38 ounce, you buy one, get one free. So it is only available on 110, which is Friday. But if we scroll down here, slowly but surely we will get there. We have, you know what's an easier way? So if you think you have a Prego coupon, go up here and just type Prego. I know I have it clipped, but I can't find it. So we're just gonna search Prego. So it shows you. Now we have a daily deal and this manufactured coupon. So that is good. You can use the manufactured coupon with the daily deal. So I know from already looking up, but you can go here and search in the store. You can search Prego's sauce. Now I need 38 ounces. So they are $3. It does not say deal available because it is not Friday. On Friday, it'll show you the coupon available for the buy one, get one free. But as you can see on here, it shows you that there are deals available. So if you click on here, it shows you that your 75 cents will come off if you buy two of them. As you see, it already calculated it. So on Friday... You're going to minus the $3 because you get buy one, get one free. So it'll minus $3 plus the 75 cents. So you get two of them for $2.25. Now it won't calculate the buy one, get one free, like I said, until Friday. So you can stack them like that and you can use this to search any items like Lysol. So I know that we just got a 50 cent off Lysol coupon. And I also know that Lysol is these Lysol wipes. And the toilet bowl cleaners are three for five dollars. If when you spend ten, you get two dollars off. So, as you see here, I just added six, showing ten dollars. But if you need a filler item, this shows you like you wouldn't think the fifty cent coupon would work on a dollar off a dollar item, but it does. It shows you that it is coming off. Now, the only reason why it says 32 cents is because I already have six in my cart. But if I delete these, delete the items, when we go back, it should show you 50 cents, not 32. It should show 50 cents. Yes, now it shows 50 cents. So this is a good filler item. If you're at 24 and you need to get to 25, this is a good filler item. So you can search all any item and it will show deals available. Um, for example, I know we have a Centrum coupon. So I'm going to go here and I'm going to search Centrum. Now it'll show you all of the ones that the coupon is working for like I know the coupon says 60 or more so we're gonna click on here and it is going to show you that the four dollar coupon works for here it says on one any 60 count or larger it didn't say that the deals were available on this one but I knew that it was the same this is just for women's and the other ones for men so you can look here now, there is a $4 coupon off. I already used mine this weekend, but it is a great filler item because you only spend a dollar out of pocket for this, but then you take the five off of 25. So I did use get three of those. 
So if we go back, we can explore all of the coupons available. You can also scan the barcode of an item when you are at the store and be able to see if there are any coupons. So those are my coupons. You can search by category on here. And these are all of the coupons that I have not clipped um, that are available. Now, sometimes there are coupons that say DG exclusive. Those are not on every single person's account. They are only on specific accounts. So, I know I have one. I have a couple of them. Let's scroll down and look and see where they are. There's some more Dollar General coupon, store coupons. Um, I know I have them. Did we just completely scroll by them? This one. I know this one is a Dollar General exclusive one. It shows up online and when it was first in my account and I clipped it, it showed the same thing. I don't know why they're not showing Dollar General exclusive. <sighs> Adjust my luck. That's how life is. Let's look. And you can scroll and see personal care. What's available in personal care? My phone would cooperate. 50 cents on Colgate. So that is how you look at the coupons. Um, if you also hit this button, I am at work, as you can see. If you scan the barcode, it will show you the price and if you have any deals available. So you, as you can see, I have a coupon on my account. Buy two, six to seven ounce flavor mix or match max value two dollars get one free so if i would add three into my account it would show you that it is only four dollars because they are priced at two dollars a piece and then you take off the two dollars for the free cheese it just showing you that you can scan that will be your best best friend um, in the world when you are in a store scanning make sure you scan your items to make sure that the coupons do come off there are a lot of times where you think an item will come a coupon will come off of an item and it does not Make sure you scan. Even though I knew that this coupon was going to work for the Cheez-Its, I still scan everything before I put it in my cart. Just because I want to make sure that the coupon is going to come off. So you can scroll through, like I said, all of them or in specific categories. You do not get penalized for how many you clip. You can clip any. I'm going to clip this one. Am I going to use it? Not sure. But it's good to have clips. Now it disappeared because it went over to my, no, right there it is. But when you come back into it, it will go over to your my coupons and not be in the all of the coupons. So we're going to clip that one. Like I said, you do not get penalized. You can clip all of the coupons if you want. But if there's a coupon that you think you might use, you like, that it might be a good deal, clip it because sometimes if you don't clip it, it does go away. For some reason or another, it goes away. So clip them. If you don't use them, okay. If you do use them, great. But make sure that if you want an item, clip them. Because sometimes you don't think about it when you go to the store and you're like, oh, sweet, I have this coupon because you've seen it, but you didn't clip it or you've seen someone else share it in a group or whatnot. And you're like, oh, sweet, I have this coupon. I've done it before. And then you get 
to the register you punch your phone number in and then you get in the car and you're like wait why was it so high and it's because you didn't clip the coupon and you thought you did it's happened to me plenty of times this car calculator you use it to scan products it finds the deals and coupons and you know your total before paying at the register that's what i do every saturday and it is great now you need to be in a store to use this feature i'm not in a store as you know so you can make your list um i write all of mine down on paper we will go through that i just wanted to go on the app show you everything you can find a store close to your area it shows you you can look at the ads um and you can click on an item it will bring it up specific if you need any specifics on the item and the ad is really cool because it does tell you sometimes when there are digital coupons so let's scroll like right here it shows you that there is a dollar general digital coupon for buy one get one 50 percent off which is pretty cool i think so um showing you that you know what deals you can use so definitely you want to look at the ad um, sometimes what I do is I bring the ad up on my computer or have the paper ad because it's a pain in the butt to be flipping through ads then to your coupons then to the home screen to search um, for items but just be I just wanted to make you guys aware of what is available on the app so you guys can start couponing with me if you want. I'm going to make up some scenarios for Saturday the 11th that we can do. And I'm going to show you all the breakdowns. Um, I might do another screen recording just to show you the breakdowns and the coupons added and all the items and what the items look like. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this was inform informative. Um, if you have any questions about Dollar General couponing or anything of that sort, please let me know. Sometimes in my breakdowns, I will use paper coupons. I will show you those paper coupons, let you know. Um, I would suggest if you want to start couponing, get the paper every day. Um, not every day, every Sunday. I buy mine at the Dollar Tree. It's only a dollar, and you get great coupons in them. Sometimes you can use all the coupons. Sometimes you don't. It it all depends. Um. But I would, if you want to just do all digital, that's great. Most of my deals are all digital, but sometimes there's a really good paper coupon that I just throw in there. Um, but if that's not, if you don't have the paper coupons and you don't want to use the paper coupons, that's totally okay. Then you just put filler items like that Lysol or whatever the case may be. You can put whatever you want in your couponing. I'm just going to show you what I put in. I'm going to make a couple different scenarios up. But if there's something that you don't want, like if I put uh, this creamer in and you don't drink coffee, you don't know anybody who does drink coffee, you don't want it, then you got to figure out another scenario for yourself. It's all about what you want to do. I just so show you some good breakdowns and everything like that. All right, guys. Thank you so much. I hope you guys have an awesome day. Bye.